Hello. <laughs> Again. Discord notification by down. Odd. Very good. Uh, pardon me. Hi. I know. Enjoy your seminar. Amaranthine. Amaranthine is a chilly rock world of an atmosphere of carbon dioxide and nitrogen. Uh, its frozen surface consists largely of light titanium and aluminium oxides, with deposits of thorium and other heavy metals located in the deep crust. Amaranthine was named by the human poet Sophia Cabral during her tour of duty aboard the Alliance of Airship Coop. Under the dim light of the Red Dwarf Fortuna, Okay, I will shout. The surface of this world is rich, is lit in rich twilight blues and purples, even at midday. It does, it's, it does sound like a city from Dragon Age. Also, hello, Rings. How are you? This gold's confusing me. Good, glad you're fine. Maganlis. Maganlis is a rock terrestrial with an atmosphere of sulfur dioxide and trace amounts of helium. Scans reveal ancient lava plains on the surface, implying a geologically active past. The crust consists of sulfur and basalt, but the planet's mass suggests core or iron and heavier materials. Cursory drill come coring suggests the possibility of simple subterranean life. Hey, terrain insignia. I was gonna say... It does sound familiar. Maybe it's just a reference. Wentanya. <laughs> Hard data on Wentanya is very limited. When the system was charted by the Alliance of our coup, only a small, unmanned flyby probe was spared for the distant world. It is a small rock and ice planet with a trace... Oh, did it? Oh. It's not a reference, then. <laughs> no, it is more detailed survey, it suggests. The frozen terrestrial may be suitable target for mining, while it is largely water ice. Mapping of mass concentration suggests it has a core of pure aluminium. Theromlun. Theromlun is a frigid... Oh, I didn't realise Dragon Age was out that late. I thought Dragon Age was much earlier. The crust consists of silicates and various unremarkable ores, but it's surprising. It's surprising rich in phosphate since the atmosphere lacks free oxygen. The phosphates are relatively pure and could be of value in the manufacture of fertilizers and incendiary ammo. Oh. I can't remember what quest I'm doing. Oh, 
because we're here for the woman. Oh, really? Wow. I was going to bother getting, like, the resources, but I don't think I will. I'm not going to get all of them. Because I've already completed the quest. So I'm just going to get them if they're on the way. Yeah, fuck the resources. I'm just going to get them if they're on the way. But I will get the salvage, because the salvage is quite useful. I think I have got all the... Yeah, I've got them. I've got them all. I just need the leg medallions. myself that because I get health region old friend purposes the good thing is I think we're only gonna spend about 40 minutes doing these like planet things before we do some story maybe not even that so I've just got to do this this sector and another sector and that's it oh I've got Jenna out of chorus then So have I got to go back to Pharos? Oh, the old friend you were talking about will now survive. Good. Um, I've got Generate of Koros Dan. Gavin Hossel's mission. I don't know. I don't know what his mission was. I have got um, a load of Pharos stuff. Oh yeah, I've done it. I've recovered Gavin Hoss's mod design. An Alcos Combine thing. What is Alcos Combine? That's the one I'm confused on. gun manufacturer. Oh. You need the things you buy. Oh, yeah. Um, I will have a look. I should have it. Because I've bought all the...
I bought all the things, I think. I'll have a look, I'll have a look on the Normandy when I finish up here. Shepherd. <laughs> what was I that you noise? Death of gratitude. With my former partners dead, this syndicate is now mine. I could not have done it without you. Those men deserve to die. Now are we going to have a problem? Not if I can help it, Commander. I hope you can see that I am by far. But he has a degree in some fictional area of science. Ooh. Under my leadership, is it Conrad? this organization will restrict itself to gambling it and smuggling illegal technologies. There will be no drugs and no slave taking <laughs> for the Batarians. Those days are over. This gang has a reputation for drugs and slaving. It's too late to change that. Perhaps you're right. Perhaps this organization has been so tainted by those two idiots that it cannot be redeemed. If I disband the gang, I walk away freely. I have not come so far to be arrested. I would die before going to prison. I would most certainly kill before going to prison. Now, do we have a deal? You're free to go. I don't ever want to see this gang again. If I do... You won't. I'm not so foolish as to break my word to a spy. Oh, now, really? Now, excuse me, my men nice. become nervous in the presence of law enforcement I'll have to agents. see about the Alcos Combine. Sure. Hey. Go, go, go. What? Uh, is it just these gang members that are just shouting orders at each other? They are, aren't they? I thought Conrad had a wife. Oh. Is this in Mass Effect 3? Is this lighter? Let me check, let me check. Oh, in Mass Effect 2. Yeah, he's still here, look. Conrad. Yeah, Mass Effect 3. So yeah, we'll buy it. So we'll have to get the Alcos Combine. But we have done the Matriarch writings. We've done... Uh, Jenna's out of the Cora's Den and we did the other thing as well because I, I kind of like Conrad <laughs> as annoying as he is alright so we don't want to go to Noveria yet we want to clear this system and then we can do it I'm getting like discord why am I getting discord notifications Apparently my Discord has two notifications, but 
It doesn't. <laughs> Yenthal, shrouded by a thick atmosphere of complex hydrocarbons, Yenthal has never been fully mapped. The surface is hot and completely covered by a global ocean of liquid hydrocarbons. There are indications of primitive organic life deep, developing deep within the global ocean. Hey, medallion! Antitara. Antitara is a standard hydrogen helium gas giant with traces of ammonia. Hydrocarbons in the atmosphere lend it a distinct brown tint. Gas deposit. Oh! That's pretty cool. Yeah, we're keeping Conrad. <laughs> Warning, level 1 cold has... Oh, I can't land here yet because I don't have a quest for here. Zawin has a fit at... Has a thin atmosphere of carbon dioxide and ether, and the surface is frozen mainly composed of cobalt, which deposits a copper. Planet side conditions are hazardous within, with constant ice storms wrecking the surface. Oh, wait. Oh, that's the ship we need. Fasalgon, a standard hydrogen helium gas giant. Fasalgon's atmosphere is tinted blue by trace quantities of methane. Trellin. Trellin is a lifeless lock. Lock? Rock? With a trace atmosphere of xenon and krypton. Its surface contains large amounts of iron and magnesium silicates. Due to heavy... Heavily crowded terrain, starships are discouraged from landing. The Solarian religious cult claims that a certain pattern of overlapping craters in the southern hemisphere resembles their god. Oh, weird. The Majesty is a Kowloon class modular conveyor of human design. The ship is a derelict. All compartments are exposed to space, and the fusion plant is leaking. The damage is consistent with ship mounted mass accelerator fire. Ah, so this is on the planet. Oh. Alright, last one before we do some story. Yes, I've seen that Kirahai dies if um, in Mass Effect 3 because he takes quite long shit, yeah. But if they're both dead, the, the counselor dies, and then it's harder to recruit Ashley or Kaiden, whichever you've got. Yeah, I was looking at some Mass Effect stuff, just because I wanted to see if I could get perfect play through. Um, go left. Yeah. <laughs> Just need one leg medallion. Okay, good, good, good. <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Oh yeah, I, I, you can get that name from somewhere. I swear you can. Come on then. 
fuck out. Later. How are you? Damn it, I missed that. I am, I'm fighting a more. because it's repairing. <laughs> this is how you cheat with these. Rex encountered Brooks, a character you'll meet in height in Mass Effect 3 around the same time of his... Ah! Oh, nice. I like law stuff. My fave teammate is Rex. Has to be Rex. Garrus is a very close second now. And then Liara. This person was trying to mark the nearby mineral deposit when he died or was killed. Oh, lovely. Well, to be fair... Oh, yeah, because it isn't that the Asari Commando. Because last stream we heard that story. About him... Um, about his uh, Asari Commando friend. There appears to be no one left at this camp. The generator is still functioning, but there are no signs of the former occupants. The camp's computer notes several locations of interest. <laughs> oh, it's just opened everything. Well, we'll go here then. I don't need materials, I'm gonna leave it. I've I've never seen read any of the comics. I'll have to um look into it. The 
beacon was a gaff trap. Oh. Oh, these are easy, watch. I know how to deal with these. Run them over, it's easy. <laughs> so easy. I used to do standing fights with them, but. To be fair, I'll have to look into them. <coughs> no alarm. Correct. Busy, busy. Um, I know a lot of it, to be fair, from like watching playthroughs of it. I just can't remember a lot of it because it's been years since I've seen anything on it. Hold the line. Oh yeah. Saren Saren was good. I think it's because it sets you up as you hate him from the very start. It's a good dynamic. Hello. <laughs> Is he busy? We have to go back to the Citadel now, don't we? Yeah, I talked to go off. But we'll do that after the story to see if we can get any more.
during the assault on Garrus's compound in Mass Effect 2, he calls his dad for advice. It's very wholesome. <laughs> I didn't, I can't remember that. Oh, I love Garrus. Right, we can do story now. There's not another planet system, is there? No, okay. We can investigate. Svarog. Svarog is a small but typical hydrogen helium gas giant whose orbit lies quite close to the star. It is unusual for a star with a close orbiting gas giant to have a habitable world. Svarog is Pax's only gas giant, but its temperature, powerful winds, and high op orbital velocity make a poor candidate for helium free mining. While Navaria enjoys plenty of full deuterium for its fusion plants, it imports all of its helium free from out system. <laughs> yeah. Why would you want to defund CSEC? Marana. Marana is an icy planetoid smaller than Earth's moon. Many planetary geologists suspect it was once an Oort cloud ice dwarf, which migrated inwards after an encounter with some other body. While the crust is frozen, water, water ice, deep layers, and mostly silicates with pockets of magnesium and aluminium, Marana is tidally locked to Pax, the same side always faces the sun. Ah, it's not very. Villis. Veles has a thin atmosphere of xenon and krypton. Most other materials are frozen and fallen as snow. Its surface is composed of potassium with deposits of magnesium. While investigating the primitive anaerobic life of Veles, binary helix survey teams discovered a cunningly hidden anchorage of the ancient Krogan warlord Morrow. Many records and artifacts of the Krogan rebellions were covered and sold at auction. The empty base is now abandoned. Hey, Magioke's writings. Oh, a fan-made comic. Nice. I'll have to have a look at it, to be fair. Navaria. Navaria is a small frozen terrestrial world, barely habitable but by conventional definitions. It is privately charted by the Navaria Development Corporation, who lease out labs to perform research too dangerous or controversial to be performed elsewhere. Given Navaria's unique situation, it is the source of many wild conspiracy theories. Oh. We shall land here. Approach control, this is the SSV Normandy, requesting a vector and a berth. Normandy, your arrival was not scheduled. Our defense grid is armed and tracking you. State your business. Citadel business. We got a council specter aboard. Landing access granted. Normandy. Be advised, we will be confirming identification on arrival. If confirmation cannot be established, your Oh, it was never finished. Oh shit! I'll take my next leave here. Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. Have to see what quests we can get in here. Hmm. Far enough. We're not here to cause problems. This is an unscheduled arrival. I need your credentials. I'm a Spectre. My name is Shepard. Load of horse crap, man. We will need to confirm that. Also, I must advise you that firearms are not permitted on Ovaria. What? Sergeant Sterling, secure their weapons. 
What the heck? Don't try it. Let's not start a fight. Why not? <laughs> Captain Matsuo, stand down. We confirm their identity. Spectres are authorized to carry weapons here, Captain. Marauder shields hold Shepard almost dead body and begs him not to fall under rape control. Use the indoctrination fear, but Jesus Christ, it's not good. It's even a voiceover on Shepard, it made me fucking cry. Oh, yeah, and I'm on Navaria. I can't remember this place, to be fair. I am Gianna Parasini, assistant to Administrator Analeas. We apologize for the incident in the docking bay. I appreciate your help. You're welcome. You understand our security chief was only doing her job. One of my duties is orientation of new arrivals. Do you have any questions? There's like three different quests here. Oh, voiceover for a certain strip. By God, it was good. I'll have to check it out. Pretty heavy security for such a small port. The executive board does everything in its power to protect the privacy of our client corporations. I can't have my investigation hampered. Tread lightly. The board can bury you in litigation. You'd need an Asari lawyer to see the case through. Has anyone unusual passed through here recently? Unusual? An Asari <laughs> you get Analyze to kill both himself Benezia. and Parasani. Oh, Jesus. Benezia. She is here. Can I speak with her? Benezia left for the Peak 15 research complex days ago. To the best of my knowledge, she's still there. Could you tell me how to get there? You'll need to ask Administrator Analeas for clearance to leave this port. Where can I find the Administrator? His office is on the main level, left at the top of the elevator. Understood. Can we go in now? Of course. If you need any help, you can ask me at the Administrator's office. She is here. I can't believe it. I imagine you want to talk to me, Shepard, about my mother. No, I don't. I trust you, Liara. You may not be military, but you're part of my crew. Thank you, Shepard. That means a great deal to me. Yeah, worst possible ending. We'll have to do that when I do a like a evil playthrough. Welcome to Port Hanshan. I've got kind of like two other playthroughs in mind of what I want to do. For your own safety and to protect the privacy of others. This is kind of a neutral playthrough. By our security more more Paragon, but still a bit neutral. Staff is always available. Thank you, and enjoy your stay. Oh, there's a Hanar. This one offers greetings. Yeah, I, I kind of feel like I would have liked Nihilus to have been a bit more developed. Indeed, esteemed Spectre. Your arrival was not greeted with any joy by the companies here. This one has a burden that you could ease. Oh. If an arrangement could be made, it would compensate you. This one has procured a special item for a customer. The item is not permitted within the station, but you could bring it through customs. You want me to use my status to smuggle for you? Then that again, we wouldn't have Marauder Shield to try and save us from the ending of Mass Effect 3. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I won't carry anything if I don't know what it is. This one must be discreet. Rest assured, the contents pose no threat to anyone within this port. I want to know where this package is going. This one's customer prefers to remain anonymous. I'd be stupid to do this without knowing I'm not equipping my own enemies. Your words are not unreasonable. This client is the Krogan in a mortar. Oh. The customer oh. is the <laughs> and here we go. <laughs> That one is a bounty hunter of some repute, and quick to anger. 
You understand this one's urgency. That other grows restless from the delay. I have no problem with that. This one humbly thanks the Spectre. The package will be delivered to your vessel. All you need do is bring it to this one. Please do not mention this to Administrator Analeas. That one would levy... fees. Cast a damn talk to him about it. Is there anything else this one might help you with? Could I buy something now? Is there anything in particular the Spectre is looking for? Let's have a look at standard items. Ooh. Ooh. Don't mind if I take that. Don't mind if I take that either. Um. Oh, it's bad shields though. Never mind then, we'll leave it, we'll leave it. Oh, does he? I didn't realise that. Wow. I did not know that. So we've got a... Smuggling tree of the package outside the Normandy in the docking bay area. Well, we can try and get it now, right? Or we'll leave it because it'd probably be best if we just grab it when we leave. I have to pay attention because you can you can kind of hear it. You can kind of hear it. Just gonna check to synthetic insights. Oh, hello, Lily Hyrax. Spectre, right? Yeah, that's me. I used to be a military tech. Except for my Eco's people, everyone's too corporate here. They just sit around sipping expensive water. What can I do for you today? It's Benda. <laughs> you seem like you have an ear to the ground. What's happening around here? There's the problems up on Peak 15. Synthetics Insights was shut down by Analeas. And a matriarch came through. It used to be a wall by Uphold Shop blocking you from getting to the hotel. They removed it, thankfully. Oh, good. Do you know where that matriarch is now? You looking for her? She took a shuttle to Peak 15 before we lost contact. What sort of problems are there at Peak 15? Don't know. There's a blizzard up there, but we've had those before. Never cut the satellite uplinks before. 15's always had a lousy reputation. Nobody talks about what they do there. And everyone sent up. <laughs> Every Cheerian is great. <laughs> what do you do here? I'm the chief mechanic for Hanshin. Just call me Lee. Humans have a problem saying my full name. Got a team of 12 under me, keeping the shuttles coming and going. What was that about synthetic insights? Scuttlebutt says Lord Keen was on the take. Zainalea so shut down SI's offices, quiet like, so no off-world lawyers come in on it. How can I get into the garage? You need a pass. You can get one from Analeas or the managers, if you can polish enough gizzard. Maybe you could let me borrow yours? Sure. If I wanted to lose my job and get sued into the next spiral arm, security tracks card use. Oh, damn it. I have to go. You need anything? I'll be here. The access to the garage is restricted. 
Fine. I was just passing by. Have a good day. Ah, so that's the garage. The garage. Ah, uh, temporarily closed. So we'll just have a look down here, just see if there's anyone worth talking to. Which I don't think there is, but still. <laughs> Sometimes the... Well, uh, what's this? Ah, it's locked. Exactly. Poli very polite. Which is good. We all like politeness. Just see if there's anything back here that which there isn't. So we'll just go to Analias' office, I think, right? Yeah, I know the Rachnaya here. <laughs> I know the Rachnaya here. Right, if, as I, when I remember, because I remember that they were in the game and I couldn't remember where they were. Excuse me, I need a moment of your time. Oh hello. The male human at the hotel bar. He's a sales rep for Binary Helix. His name is Raphael Vargas. I need you to speak with him. Do you know who I am? Everyone here knows who you are. Dullstone. That makes you ideal Double for my stone. job. You are a known quantity, or so Vargas will think. He will assume you are here to investigate his company's dirty laundry. That will distract him from your, my, real intentions. I don't know anything about Binary Helix. What would I talk to Vargas about? I represent the Aramali City Council on Thessia. Our town is known for its biotic amp crafters. Oh. What is your city's interest in Binary Helix? They do not manufacture amps. Much of BH's work relates to biotics. There are rumors that the Novaria branch has flown in Asari biotics. Powerful ones. Oh. Commandos, to be specific. We want to assess any potential risk to Asari copyrights. You will present yourself as a buyer. I don't on behalf of the Spectres or the Alliance. <laughs> discuss their military enhancement programs. Your real objective will be to distract him. I will give you a device that will crack into his personal wireless network. Oh. It will upload a variety of monitoring viruses. They will infiltrate Binary Helix when he logs onto their intranet. What's in it for me? Money, of course. I would be well paid for this. So would you. 500, 500 credits. credits. Interesting plan. I'm in. Excellent. Here is the crack. Enemy orders upstairs, by the way. Oh, so complete. we should get it. Okay. I've assembled a dossier on Vargas. So if we should like, get the the package. Behavior patterns. Tell me what you know about Vargas. He is impatient with those who waste his time. I tried to get him distracted and off topic. He concluded I was not interested in his company's services. So we've got a I noticed he has a tell. When a topic makes him nervous or uncomfortable, he has a tendency to rub the back of his neck. Right. If you see that, press, press him, him on the subject. It may distract him enough to keep him talking. In a mortar or uphold. Oh, okay. I'll go see him now. I hope to hear from you soon. Right, so what we'll do then is we'll get the package. I don't want to give it to Annalise. I'll give it straight to the buyer. Because, screw it, we're making friends. <laughs> Even though it's illegal. I don't know, because... My whole playthrough I've been like, Oh, the law is the law. So I don't know.
So should I give it to Annalise? Since that we're kind of being the law man. For some reason we've got like a weird... It gives you a pass early. Ooh. What are the consequences? What are the consequences if I um do this? Let's weigh up the options. Oh, Paul is jailed. I think we'll give it, because the thing is, like, we're, um, because we are kind of a lawman, pretty much, we've become Spice Cop. On, at least on this playthrough. Oh, Quinn won't have his job back. Which is the better out of the two, Quinn or Annalise? And he won't become admin after Annalise. Hmm. So who's Quinn? Lorik's a nice guy. Okay, we'll go with we'll we'll can we'll do yeah, Lorik Quinn. So what we'll do is we'll get Lorik Quinn to be the good guy. Yeah. We'll we'll just make friends. That's what we'll call it. Yeah, Lorik Quinn. Oh, Lorik Keen. Ah, Lorik Keen. Ah, and he's a Turian as well. So he's upstairs, didn't you say? Oh, there, there's a Krogan lock. What do you want? I've heard Opal has something for you. Like I care that you know? You as courier or something? I am. I thought it would be better to deal with you directly. Hmm. Sit down a minute. I have a business proposal. I'm paying the Hanar more than I want. I'll bet he's paying you less than you want. Sell it to me directly. Interesting. But exactly how much is this worth to you? 500 credits. You and I are both professionals. You know this is worth more than that. Kids these days, they don't know what a good weapon is worth. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Deal. Pleasure doing business with you. Likewise. Now go away. The guys wonder about people who trade packages for cash. Yeah, and it's um, isn't it Rex's brother, Dag? Oh. Oh, Reeve, Reeve. Dag dies either way, doesn't he? Dag, Dag always dies, I think. Don't hang up. Elder brother, it's me. I'm on Navaria now. I can't talk long. This call is costing ten credits a minute. It's real time from the troopers. Do you think it would be cheap? I need some information. There's an issue here with some medical sites. The manager, Laura Key, he got caught with his toes wet. The office is closed by Hanshin's administrator. 
Uh, I need you to see what you can find out about him. Are you ready for his name? Ronadrill, Gan, Swa, Bosum, Karathan, Nar, Yeedi, Bella. Ah, good. No, that's the administrator. The Hanshin administrator. Well, think about it. A Turian wouldn't risk getting his office closed. They don't compromise their team. That's drilled into the boot camp. I think the administrator is using this keen fella to draw. Ultimately, you want dog, but we want same. Ah, got you, got you. But do you think I'm likely to get any unfiltered data through Novaria's own network? That, and it would take forever for any out-system search results to get back here. Thank you, Elder Brother. I have to go. Yes. I'll speak to you soon. Come on, let's talk to this Can guy. I help you? Mr. Vargas, I'm Commander Shepard, a Spectre. I understand you work for Binary Helix. That's correct. Raphael Vargas sales. Were you interested in our services? I might be. That depends on what sort of offer your company can make. It was my understanding that the Citadel contracted to a Solarian Corporation for its enhancement programs. I'm sure you know that we pass a new budget every fiscal year. If it delivers a better soldier, contracts can change. A sound business practice. Excuse my hesitation, I've never heard a government accused of good business sense. First, the boilerplate disclaimer. No genetic enhancement is guaranteed to take. Every Krogan with white armor and a brown head like no dies. They didn't have the scales, but the art like that does. Ah. Percent improvement in adrenal response, twelve percent faster clotting, and a measurable decrease in CG muscle degeneracy. I've never heard of a technique that improves zero gravity endurance. It's a first for the industry. The advent of element zero based artificial gravity made it a less pressing concern. We're still waiting for tests to give us an average improvement. We estimate a 7 to 11 percent decrease in muscle loss rates. Oh. I can get you those improvements for 30k credits per head. Oh, he's embarrassed. In quarter, I can work in a sensory enhancement so push this. Guaranteed 2015 vision and hearing from 12 to 22,000 hertz. <laughs> it, it, I don't know, it's weird, isn't it? How would you distribute the upgrades? Retroviral injections would take some time. Well, it does take time to upgrade a body with adjusted DNA. Skin cells could be replaced in two weeks, but the liver takes over a year, the skeleton a decade. For frontline units, we can speed the process with full system transfusions and injections to stimulate regrowth. It would still take six months to see results. I have to admit, it surprised me that you were here for business. There are many development projects on Avaria, some not entirely legal. I wear a lot of hats, Mr. Vargas. Some days I shut down criminals, some days I defuse nukes, some days I like to enjoy private vices. You understand me? I suppose. My apologies. Your manner is rather informal for a business meeting. Paddock Wilkes, cool. Sounds like my crew needs me for something. I'll be in touch. Of course, Commander Shepard. We look forward to doing business with There we go. We've done that. <laughs> Any results? Your toy did its job. Excellent. Morning's replacement if you die. I will died. transfer 500 ah. credits to your account. Only 500. All right. I thought you might have wanted to provide more, since you couldn't do it yourself. I mean. Did I say 500 credits? I meant 750. <laughs> Good day. We're just Patrick. squeezing, just squeezing them. There we go. Bit more renegade, but oh well. And journal. Right, let's just look at squad. He has similar reasons to do, but not really. Ah, I see, I see. Afternoon. Sit down, have a drink. What can I do for you? Who might you be? Loric Keen. For the moment, I am the manager of the Synthetic Insights office. Having some trouble with your office? Mr. Analeas closed my office. He claims to be investigating reports of my corruption. The administrator is an interesting man. He's become quite wealthy since he took direct control of rents. I sense a connection there. Indeed. I acquired evidence of Analeas' actions. His hired goons are ransacking my office to find it. Oh. I suspect your goal lies outside this port. Mr. Analeas would be disinclined to let you wander. 
If you recover the evidence from my office, I will give you my garage pass, as well as a sum of credits. Why didn't Analeas cancel your pass clearance? Why should he? There's nothing outside but snow and hungry Nafak. How did you get a pass? I'm a manager. Most executives on Novaria are free to come and go as they will. He tells you in a cut email. Ah. You have a plan? I do. However, there is one other... What is that charming human expression? Fly in the lotion? <laughs> That's not an expression. <laughs> Violence against Mr. Analeas' thugs may be necessary. He has members of Han Shan's security team searching my offices. Ah. Oh. He's paying them under the table. Miss Matsuo is unaware of their outside employment. I'll focus on trying to get your evidence. If I'm lucky, I won't have to fight anyone. Excellent. Here is my pass into our offices. It will activate the elevator. The evidence is on my office computer. This OSD contains an encryption key to access it. Slide it into the drive and it will auto-execute. Oh, and do try to keep bloodstains off the carpets, would you? Basically, if they're a dickhead, kill them. Yeah. Fought as much, fought as much. Um, let's just see. My door keeps opening and shutting and it's really annoying. Let me just shut it. Wait, where is Annalise? I've never seen I haven't seen him yet. <laughs> Back and on the ground floor. Okay. We'll talk to him, say what he wants. the elevator. Okay. Ah. I'll be down here. Oh, now over why? Okay. Oh, is in his over here? Or is he on the left, left side? Oh, he's here. How can I help you? I'd like to speak to Analeas. One moment, please. Mr. Analeas? Yes, what, what? Commander Shepard is asking to see you, sir. Right, fine, come in. Ah. You will excuse me if I don't stand up. I have no time to entertain refugees from that urban blight called Earth. Oh. I see you looked up my service record. 
Only a fool enters negotiation without knowledge of the other party's tendencies. This greeting is a courtesy. I will only cooperate as required by the executive board. Business has come here to avoid the second guessing of galactic law. Are you telling me you have no safety protocols? Don't be ridiculous. Do you think a for-profit company would take no precautions <laughs> against loss of life and material? I know, it's very Project all confusing. To be fair, I should be alright. meddlesome politicians. Or I don't want to investigate that, do I? Do you do business with Saren? Agent Saren? One of your Spectre compatriots? He's a major investor in Binary Helix Corporation, which is one of Novaria's backers. Is Binary Helix developing weapons for him? It's possible, given his interests. What our clients do in their labs is their business. Is there some problem on Peak 15? An area of severe weather has cut off contact. Things will return to normal in a few days. I've heard an Asari matriarch is here. Venezia? She arrived a few days ago, accompanied by a personal escort and some cargo. She's up at Peak 15. What, so? Oh, uh, your mother is alive. Well, we're not a spectre. Uh, uh, we're not a spicer. <laughs> what can you tell me about her cargo? Large, heavy, and sealed. It passed weapon screening. Beyond that, it is not our concern. What do you mean, personal escort? The phrase is self explanatory. Um, Bodyguards attending to the safety of her person, we mainly are. Asari commandos. You let Asari who can kill you with their brains run around, but give us flack about guns? They followed all our regulations. I had no reason to forbid Lady Benezia from taking them. I'd like to see her, immediately. I'm afraid that you cannot. Peak 15 is a private facility in the Scotty Mountains. Regardless, there is a blizzard in the area. Shuttles are grounded and surface access has been cut off. What brought her out here? If I knew, I wouldn't be at liberty to say. She came here as Agent Saren's executor. Oh. She's here on business for Binary Helix. There were issues at Peak 15 that required Saren's attention. Back to my other questions. Every minute of my time you waste costs the company 12 credits. I will keep a running tally. Why is Synthetic Insights closed? I have placed Laura Keen, the manager of the Hanshan office, under internal review. I cannot comment further at this time. Laura Keen wants me to break into his own office. He says you're corrupt. Indeed. Surely you can see his story as a lie to cover his own crimes. You have any proof of that? I will soon enough. My security teams are seeing to the matter. As a small item of note, Mr. Keene has hidden away certain records that would greatly aid my investigation. If you happen to recover them, I would be in your debt. You understand me? I'm leaving. Good. I received a dozen urgent messages while you dithered about. Okay, so he wasn't a help then. Ow, 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 ow. Right, so... Well, actually, you're writing a fanfic about ship that was supposed to have all three history things. War Hero, Ruthless, and Soul Survivor. Ooh, that might be interesting. Right. So here's the cover story. We're going to say... Oh yeah, definitely. I'll have a read. I like reading. Oh Jesus. Freeze! Hanshan security. This office is sealed. What are you doing in these offices? The administrator's orders. Laura Keene is under investigation. Analeas is paying you to shake this place down. Does Captain Matsuo know you're here? Hey, I'm not the one who wants Keene. Analeas has a varin up his ass about this guy. How about this? You pretend you didn't see us, we'll pretend we didn't see you. Oh, there you go. What? The fuck? I didn't really want to kill you, but okay. Ow. <laughs> Get 
Spaghetti Fluke. To be fair, I, I can write really well, I just don't ever do it sort of thing. I should really, I should get in, back into it. Alright, let's look at equipment. Oh, yes. And then Leara. So, any. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, there we go. Turn around, snap line rounds. Over 2,000 characters, so you have to send the farm. That's fine. To be fair, I could. Like, I, used, I had a story ages ago that I could. Um, that I was interested in doing. And I didn't finish it. No short seven episode show on YouTube. It's godly and I've written fanfics of it. Oh, I'll do it. Definitely link me that as well. I struggle uh, with finding stuff. Was that new equipment then? Because I struggle with um, finding stuff on YouTube to watch. So I'm always looking for new stuff. D&D game. Oh, hello. There's people here. I don't think you're supposed to be in here, Shepard. No, I'm not. Are you? I'm Sergeant Kyra Sterling, Ilanis Risk Control Services. Analeas would throw you off world for what you did here. I won't. You know what we did to cop killers on my world? You're breaking the law for bribe money. You know what we do to dirty cops on my world? I didn't want to fight them. They fired first. Well, I don't need a gun to rip you to pieces. Bye. I will. I, I might like just react to it on stream or something. Let me just do assassination. You made me lose that. Busy. <laughs> Absolute, yeah. 
I, I think there was probably a peaceful solution to that then. <laughs> that I just completely didn't do. Oh, she's just a bitch. Okay, then. Oh, hello. Commander, there have been reports of noise from the Synthetic Insights office. Would you know anything about it? Speak plain. What's your interest? Not here, Spectre. Meet me at the hotel for a drink before you talk to Keen. I'll be waiting. Okay, let's... Let's listen to this, then. Listen to what she's got to say. to reintroduce myself. Parasini, Novaria Internal Affairs. Oh, Internal Affairs. Why is an Internal Affairs agent here? The Executive Board knows about Analeas's corruption. I've been undercover for six months. I want you to convince Keen to testify before the Board. With his evidence, this planet can run profitably again. Oh, first criminal in the autistic group is too good a couple to not write about them. Oh, I will have to look at this because that sounds brilliant. You work for Analyze. Can't you just take his records? <laughs> He's a crook, not a moron. He doesn't keep logs on his computer saying, This month I stole three million credits. Keen's testimony and records are everything I need to prove Analyze's guilt in one package. Why don't you ask Keen directly? I'm Analyze's secretary. You think he'd believe me? That he'd meet me in some dark alley with his evidence? I thought corruption was the rule on Novaria. The rule is I will don't definitely rock check it out. Self I is might like react to it, it on stream or something. Analeas is driving customers away. So it has been out of and I love a boss, but less animation. I like animated stuff though, I, I think need it's, King's um, garage pass to complete my It's mission. impressive. I could never you do it. My investigation. I'll provide whatever you need. Favor oh, favor for a favor. favor. I'll do it. In the long run, it is better to remove the source of the problem. It is. Look, Shepard, I don't like this either. You specters play fast and loose with the law. That's bad for business. What's happening up on Peak 15? Before the weather closed in, Hanchan received a Code Omega signal from him. Code Omega means a terminal breach of safety protocols. No one goes up until the crew sends an all clear. And if the crew never sends an all-clear? The executive board votes whether or not to destroy the facility. One antimatter warhead from the battle stations vaporizes all contaminants. Would you get into a call with me, my bag? Yeah, yeah, I'll do it. That doesn't tell me much. That's all I've got. No one knows I might not like do it there. on Saturday when I get back from work. How can I get to Peak 15? The shuttles are down, so you'd have to drive up. If you get keen to testify, I'll get into the garage. Garage. Do you know why the matriarch is here? Something to do with Peak 15. She arrived after we received their Code Omega, automated warning of a containment breach. She came with an escort of Asari commandos. They took the last shuttle up to Peak 15 with a load of crates. I hate All right, I'll talk to Keen and see if I can convince him. Thank you. You know where I work. Come talk to me once you know if he'll play ball. Oh my god, there's so much backwards and forwards. <laughs> Always a pleasure, Spectre. Any news on that matter I asked you to look into? I finished the job, but an internal affairs investigator contacted me. She wants you to testify against Analeas. Now that you have my property, you want to dictate how I use it. I have no interest in a public spectacle. Everyone on this station is chafing under Analeas' extortion. 
so many options, it's too good to complain about. Ooh. My employers rely on the goodwill of the executive board to work here. If these executives don't blame Analeas for provoking this, they're fools. You should eat them. All right. It is obvious that I cannot dissuade you. Very well. I will testify. Oh, Paragon 24. Make whatever arrangements you need with your contact. I will wait here. All right. So he's going to testify, which is good. For some reason, I've got like a ball patch on my head. It's so weird. given any more consideration to my offer? It took some persuasion, but Keen has agreed to testify. <sighs> That's a world of stress off my back. I'll take the evidence for safe transport. <laughs> I didn't think you'd help me, being a specter and all. I guess some of you can be alright. I'll leave you to your work. Uh, not so fast, hero. You need to get into the garage, don't you? To head up to peak 15? I do, I do. While you were working on Keen, I got you a garage pass. Be careful up there. Hey, excellent. I have an arrest to make. Wish I had time to change into something easy to move in. I hate skirts. <laughs> this is an outrage. I'll see that you never work in this sector again. Oh. Yeah, yeah, get a move on. <laughs> you, Shepard! I demand you place this bitch under arrest! Oh, you have to remain silent. I wish to God you'd exercise it. See you around the galaxy, Commander. I owe you a beer. Potty mouth, potty, potty, potty mouth. Two of the other main characters are pink haired wannabe villain who joined a literal pyramid skill. It's actually nice and a 12 year old little girl who works like 5 to 12 a.m. because her dad is kind of abusive. Oh, so there is like quite some like nice, um, he just trades a well. Really, now physical. Oh, he doesn't trade a while, just really, now physical. Okay. Katana 10. Alright, let's get into the garage. What other? Say privateers. Oh. Oh, so there isn't a quest. I haven't got a quest in there. Okay, good, good, good. So we can probably just get straight into that then. So there is quite some like character development. The access to the garage is restricted. I have to stick to, to Percy and the rat fires come yes, and Ramsey genuine. and Jesus Christ. Drive safely. Oh the weather's supposed to be pretty bad out in the Aleuts Valley. Definitely have to look. Sounds like there's um quite a lot of in-depth character stuff. What the heck? Oh, for God's sake, these things again. You will die. So that's what the Asari had in the crates. Ow. Where are these things? Fan out and secure the area. No one gets in or out. What did you do here, Commander? The Geth ambushed us. We fought back. That's it. <laughs> Geth, you expect me to... 
Where did they come from? The Asari bitch came with a bunch of cargo. They were probably packed in those. I don't believe that. We did thorough scans of those. There were no power sources, no element zero masses. If Benezia Sama's containers were packed with these things, there are many more. Also, out a there. six foot fray, stingy cowgirl who wants a bounty on her, they said. Wow, it sounds like it's fun. It sounds like it's a fun, like, series. We've fought Geth before. We'll take care of them for you. I, I appreciate that. My people are good, but few of them have combat experience. I must report to the executive board. If word gets out about loose Geth, there may be an investor panic. Okay. And by stinky, you mean stinky. Oh, lovely. Let's get into Mako. She sleeps in the woods. Oh, odd. <laughs> Oh, we leveled up. Good, good, good. Um. Oh, we could charm. I missed that then. Um, I just want a map. Why is that? Random waypoint, man. No. It also only has towers and water for a male. Sometimes butter water. <laughs> hey, you frats, welcome back. Stick a butter in her glass of water. Oh god. Uh, game's going well. We're back onto some story stuff. Finally. Oh, is this the Colossus? You don't scare me, Suki. There we go. Yeah. 
Why? My driving is fine. Driving's not a problem at all. program on the shop. User alert. All Peak 15 facilities have suffered a great deal of damage. Biohazard materials present throughout facility. Virtual intelligence user interface offline. Oh. Why are the turrets facing the wrong way? They want to keep their people in as much as they want to keep others in. Would you rather be donned by a hot six foot very stinky cat girl named Zora or marry a quirky autistic girl with short blonde hair? Um, I'm, I'm a fan of blonde short hair so... Probably the cop.
up with those? I'll tell you what. The thing is, they're all pretending like they haven't seen them before, but we literally in infiltrated a, a Cerberus base that had them. <laughs> and it's like, oh, what? Weapons research. No. Oh, really? Out the walls. <laughs> oh yeah, I'll have to like upgrade the difficulty. Um Oh my god, that's rough. Attempt to manually reconfigure. Oh. Transfer modules stacked core two or three to reactivate. Start. I was one shot by those small green fuckers because of the stupid saves. It's only on normal difficulty. Oh, Jesus. No idea what I'm doing. Thank <laughs> you. 
so confused. I mean, I mean, let's just Google this. Fuck it. <laughs> we spent enough time doing it. Um. Tower of Hanoi puzzle, apparently. Ah. I think I might have worked it out. So what I want to do is hit this. Oh shit, um... Basically, basically, I need to like move all of those, but I don't know which one to move them to. So, basically, I have to move these all, but I can't move... Oh! so hard because it's right let's set them all let's set it all back so x needs to go to y x needs to go to b then y needs to go to b then x needs to go to y b needs to go to x B needs to go to Y. X needs to go to Y. X needs to go to B. Y, B, Y, B, Y, X, B, X, Y, 
B, X, Y, X, B, Y, B. There we go, done it. It looks like you're trying to restore this facility. Would you like help? Help would be great. Who are you? This system is monitored to respond to the name Mira. May I ask your name? As soon as it said that it was a Tower of Hanoi puzzle, I just I just reset it and then just worked it out. Commander Shepard, I work for the Citadel Special Tactics and Reconnaissance. One moment, please. I just needed Council to figure out confirmed. where it wanted me to you go. You are entitled to secure access of all systems. Please note that queries relating to corporate secrets require privileged access. Privileged access is only available to binary helix executives. This system is ready to process queries. You may access me at any holographic interface within peak 15. I need to find Matriarch Benezia. Lady Benezia departed on the passenger tramway to the Rift Station subsidiary labs. User alert. The tramway system is currently inoperable. What's the situation here? One moment, please. Diagnostics in progress. Critical failure. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Critical failure. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger tram systems are offline. Report complete. Do you have an additional system status query? Do you know why the reactor was shut down? I'm sorry, but I was offline at the time. Shutdown could occur if reactor breach seems likely, or in the case of catastrophic laboratory containment failure. Oh dear. Emergency guidelines suggest the frigid environment will kill biological contagions. It may also damage mechanical ones. Turn off the heat and hope the cold puts whatever you've unleashed to sleep. What do I need to do to get the power back on? The valves to the Helium-3 fuel line must be opened. This can be done at the controls on the reactor assembly proper. What are the landlines and why are they disabled? The landlines connect my mainframes here at Central Station to the various sub-facilities of Peak 15. This allows the crew to remotely access my databases from the comfort and security of their labs. When emergency protocols were implemented within the hot labs, the cabling was automatically ejected. Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. Tell me what occurred immediately before you shut down. Stage one alert issued at hot labs. Contaminants released from laboratory pod gamma. Emergency protocols implemented. Oh. Stage two alert issued at hot labs. Isolation two breached. Oh, Tram dear. shut down. Landline to hot labs disconnected. Stage three alert issued locally. Contaminants in tram tunnels. Station shut down and evacuation initiated. Code Omega sent. What sort of contaminants escaped? I'm sorry, Commander. Inquiries related to our research require privileged access. Only executives of Binary Helix have that level of clearance. The creatures we've encountered here, did they come from the labs? I'm sorry, Commander. Oh. Inquiries related to our research require privileged access. Only executives of Binary Helix have that level of clearance. Why were you taken offline? In the event, Peak 15 must be sterilized for security purposes. My program and data are purged. They kill you if something goes wrong? My systems are permanently disabled. To be killed, I would need to be alive. I am merely a database program. That's all I need right now. Yeah, exactly. Well, Commander. Logging or if it out. didn't name them. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. So, journal. And lines. So. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. Now exiting to the roof. User alert. Landline connections <laughs> are disabled. Passenger 
Yeah, yeah if you got to it first and it's like, it, it adds a bit of tension because it's like, well, what got out? are repaired. Connections restored. Processing new data. User alert. Unable to connect to hot lab facilities. Do you know why the react? Emergency guideline. Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. What's the status of Rift Station? Rift Station has been locked down by the staff. There are presently no contaminants within the facility. Give me a status report on the hot labs. I am sorry. The network connections to the labs have been damaged. Data is limited. You have no idea what's going on inside. I'm afraid not. <sighs> My last log entry is shortly after the yeah. stage two containment alert was sounded. Give me an overview of the facility. Doubt. <laughs> the hot labs isolate dangerous biological or cybernetic contaminants during development. The complex is built within a glacier. In the event of an accident, it can be irradiated and sunk into the ice. That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. Press F to doubt. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. It reminds the voiceover reminds me of um, Halo Frey when Miranda Keys goes. Anyone in the barracks? I need a sit rep now. And like her voiceovers. Barracks. I need a sit right now. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Now entering main reactor. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Rex is like 700. Oh damn. I can't remember Andromeda. I did complete it, but I, I just honestly cannot remember it. It's not a very memorable game. You're telling me is that his hips cannot lie. <laughs> Let's go upstairs just. 
I saw some some things. This is what I saw. Badass bar fight with Ryder. Oh, I might remember that. Maybe I can't remember. Online, connected to subsidiary facilities. How may I assist you? What's this about loose contaminants? Dangerous biological agents are present in the tramway decontamination chamber. The tram station has been sealed in the interest of crew safety. Activation of the fail-safe plasma jets is recommended prior to access. How do I activate the fail-safe system? Controls for the fail-safe systems are located in the security checkpoint it wasn't hard, outside but it's still decontamination. Cool. I can't remember. User alert. The fail-safe system is currently inoperable. Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I'm That's all I need. very well, Commander. Logging you out. Oh, for God's sake. Um, Zalcoris. I might need a reminder on that. <laughs> now entering decontamination and transit hub. User alert. Loose contaminants in the decontamination chamber. Access to passenger tramways inadvisable. Why does it say I've got six notifications, but I've only got three? What to do here? Does this oh there we go. It says there's like two hidden notifications. The quarian who's addicted to you and telling Mass Effect 2 but is literally the second best quarian in Mass Effect 3. Ooh, I'm not sure. They're locked in. The door could be Bye. <laughs> Predator nine. Control group losing the. They're in. We can't escape. Up the tunnels now. We're sorry. The leads couldn't get to the struck. Come out while you can. He killed himself. Because he was part of whatever happened here. Among my Three people, a suicide's body oh. will be left for scavengers. The Nathak will get to him eventually. Online, connected to subsidiary facilities. How may I assist you? Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I'm That's all I need. very well, Commander. Logging you out. Please, Tally, stop shooting.
Oh. Oh wait, where are they? <laughs> Get back here. I need backup. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I already shot something and killed it through a wall. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. I'm sorry. I it, I got distracted by talking about Tally. <laughs> See if we can get a massive light zoom in on Rex's face. Oh, there's some eyeballs, look. <laughs> now arriving at Rift Station, Binary Helix Research Facility. That's America's ass right there. <laughs> nice red balls. Oh, he's the only Krogan with blue eyes. I know that you can save the Rachni Queen, and I think in the long run it's best if we save the Rachni Queen. I think, maybe. Stand down. Sorry, we couldn't be sure what was on the tram. Those things work at trains controls? Hell if I know. I'm not assuming any goddamn thing. Look, you're human and that's enough that I won't shoot. But I'd like to know who you are. My name is Shepard. I'm a specter. Huh. I won't look a heavily armed horse in the mouth. The God, aliens overran it. the hot labs last week. Only Han Olar got out and he ain't all there anymore. Oh dear. First we knew the bastards were clawing into my command post. We had a lot more staff then. You were taken by surprise and had civilians to protect. You did a good job, Captain. Yeah? Sure as hell doesn't feel like it. The board sent an Asari to clean up the mess. She went to the hot labs yesterday. We haven't heard from her since. I'm not gonna let any of your people die. All I can do is hold out here and protect the civilians. There's an emergency elevator out by the trams. This card will let you activate it. It can take you down to the hot labs. Oh, and if you need any first aid, Dr. Cohen's downstairs in the med bay. Tell me about Rift Station. I can't talk about everything. What do you need to know? Tell me about the defenses here. Secure enough that you shouldn't poke in corners. I was just impressed with your operation. Being able to weather a week of assaults is no mean feat. Only the best get assigned to high security facilities like this. Oh. What impresses me most is the turrets, alarms, and cameras. They're all routed through a central location out by the quarantine labs. Ah. One guy can lock down the whole facility. The security hub's the last logical fallback, and we'd have cover from the turrets all the way. What kind of research is done here? Beats me. I'm not supposed to know. So long as people don't start dying, it's not my problem. What can you tell me about the aliens? Ask Dr. Olar. He's the only one who made it out of the hot labs. He's the only Volus left in here. Oh, Volus. I need to know more about the situation in the hot labs. The facility's off the network. The only way to find out would be to send scouts down the elevator, and I won't send my people to their death. Did the aliens come from inside the facility, or did they attack from outside? You want my personal opinion? Labs like that exist to do stupid crap that gets people killed. Tell me about the structure of the hot labs. It's built into one of the glaciers further down the mountain. Real old, thick, stable. If something goes wrong, they heat it up and sink it into the ice. Oh. Normally, the crew gets to the labs using a tram from Central Station. We've got an elevator that connects directly, but it's for emergency use only. Uh, listen. I'm not sending my people down there. It's too dangerous. You understand? Don't go to the hot labs, by the way. Okay, don't go to hot labs. You're certain the matriarch is still in the hot labs? She hasn't come back here. You came through Central Station, so she ain't there. How are your people holding up? We weren't expecting the initial wave. We made it inside. We lost some good people. Those of us left are shorthand. Oh, he's lying. Stems. 
I don't like it, but I don't see an alternative. I've got work to do. Yeah, I hear that. Hell, man the perimeter. Rex, get out of the line. <laughs> Thanks for the help. Every few hours a group comes up the tram tunnel. It's actually better since we locked down the elevator. They always attack here? It's an obvious kill zone. Their only other option is over the mountain and down through the ducts. And they freeze like everyone else. I don't know why they keep throwing themselves against our defenses. Even animals should learn not to stick their noses where it hurts. This is odd. What happens if we go to Hot Labs? Where did they come from? Were they in the lab? I never went in the high security areas. What? You're a member of the science teams? Recently transferred, yes. What do you do here? Molecular oh, he'll attack and you won't be able to do shit. Enhanced allele specific hybridization. Think you could translate that into galactic? <laughs> it's a genetic thing, forget it. You seem less upset at this situation than the others. That is one of the virtues of the meditation you interrupted. Oh, that's so sorry. Tell me about yourself. I am Molestia Alice from the University of Arrhenius. Is there anything in particular you want to know, or should I just spout random facts? Did I interrupt something? <sighs> I was meditating. I suppose to a species as brash as yours, it would appear to be inattention. Oh, Do you know Matriarch Benezia? Why ask me, and not your friend? Because I do not know anything about the Matriarch. Then why would I? Oh, all right. Hey, That's all for now. <laughs> then I will return to. Uncertain. I welcome you. Cautiously, <laughs> I am curious to know what you're doing here. I heard there were some problems up here. Furtively, I am concerned about the state of our guards. Many have been awake for oh, days. For now, I'll have that with forced one. cheer. I still have a limited supply of equipment to sell. Let's have a look. Regretfully, most of my stock has been appropriated she seems by Captain Ventralis. Oh. Um. Volkov, which we've got. It's heavy armor. Light armor. Oh. Oh no, it's it's better protection, but it's worse for that, so we'll leave that. We'll take this though. What? No. Sorry, I haven't had much sleep since the attack. Is there something you need? What sort of work do you do here? I can't say. I signed a non-disclosure agreement. If we survive, I'd like to keep my job. The location is terrible, but the pay is better than any other commercial lab. You're not happy on Peak 15? The outside world doesn't exist here. Just walls of ice and rock. There's only the work, the discovery. Mm. It's easy to forget why science is guided by ethics. Maybe we're paying for that now. Oh. What do you know about the hot labs? Nothing. I didn't work there. As far as I know, Han Olar was the only survivor. Is he in the medical ward? No, he's staying in the science team's quarters. Be gentle with him. He had a trying experience. What do you do here? I'm a toxicologist. I can't talk about my work. Not that I'm doing anything since the accident. There was an accident here? I can't talk about what happened. Not here. Too public. Oh. Talk to Dr. Cohen in the medical ward. He was the project lead. Ah. 
I'm looking for an Asari. Asari? Well, there's Dr. Ayalis over there. There's also our guest, Lady Benezia. Captain Ventralis might know where she is. What do you do here? I'm a toxicologist. I can't talk about my work. Not How are you holding up? It would be petty to complain after showering off a co-worker's brain. Oh. None of us have had enough sleep since the attack. Of course, not all of us have guns. I'll talk to you later. Remember to report any suspicious noises. Um, to restricted area. Oh, these are the turrets, right? That woman, <laughs> she seems Zeus. by the aliens they're suffering from a toxin it was an accident i have a non-disclosure agreement i shouldn't discuss it with anyone outside of the company but you're going to because i might be able to help i'd like to think that the company finds our lives more valuable than their secrets you know mira the vi for peak 15 she handles the safety protocols for our experiments here we reactivated her on our way through central station that was you i'm grateful until she came online, the automatic equipment wouldn't work. We lost the connection to Mira in the middle of an experiment and the quarantine failed. Oh, These three damn. were exposed to a toxin, something we were working on. I understand your caution, but I need details. What you say won't go beyond these walls. It's a bioweapon, based on an exotic life form discovered on the frontier. They wanted something that could kill the creature. But there was no profit in something that kills one species on the frontier. We kept working on it and adapted it to affect more species. More species. Forest B is highly infectious, but can't pass from one person to another, like a bio-war attack without a pandemic spread. Uh, do you imagine that distinction makes this ethical? Military. I know who the voice fact actor is for this. It's um, to limit the damage. Doug I something. Can't see that. No, it's not. It's um, Dw uh, Dwight. Dwight, oh, I can't, it's something that begins with a D. Is there a cure, Doctor? A treatment? Our first priority was getting it working. We were close to synthesizing an antidote when Mira went down. Our notes and equipment are locked in the quarantine lab. Dwight Schultz, that's his name. Dwight Schultz. Dwight Schultz, that's what his name is. Um, he does a lot of, um, voice acting I'll talk to him maybe I can convince him to let me try I can't ask you to do this officially but if you can do anything I'd appreciate it he's um talk to you later I hope you can do something where's Hans or Orvlar or whatever his name is Alarm, scientist. Oh, quarantine and barracks. What's this? No. Yeah, um, Dwight Schultz, he does, um, he voices some of the orcs on, um, Shadow of, uh, Shadow of Mordor and Shadow of War. So that's Medical Bay, that's Restricted Area. That's Quarantine and Barracks. He did, yes. It's the same guy, yeah. Something you need? I've heard about the problems in the quarantine lab. 
I'd like to recover the toxin cure. God, I wish we could help those guys. I really do, but we can't risk contamination now. We're not part of your defense plans. We're consuming extra rations, extra metagel. Yeah, but you also have extra guns. All right, you want to gamble with your life, you're not under my command. I'll have the guard let you in, but he'll lock the door behind you. Ooh. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's pressed layer things as well, yeah. Any anomalies, you stay in there. Those are reasonable precautions. I'll radio ahead to let the guard know. Good luck. I've got work to do. You and me both. So... Quarantine, yes. Where's that Orvlar bro bloke or whatever his name is? He's supposed to be up here. Or is he in quarantine and barracks? Is he down here? Ah, there he is. Okay, this one will get you. So this hydrogen atom is next to another hydrogen. I lost my electron. Earth is one. And the other hydrogen says. out about them didn't you you mean those things out there yes I'm the only survivor from the hot lab you know I need to know more about those things out there about the rachni rachni that's preposterous where did they come from they found it in a derelict ship an egg the waiting since the last battles they brought it here. Shut up! God, you want to get us killed? I don't have any control over who lives or dies here. Do you? If you're going to be crazy, be the quiet kind. Crazy? I'm sane. God, am I sane. I need to know everything about the Ragnarok. I told you all I can. We brought the Ragni back from the dead. <laughs> Go back to your jokes. <laughs> Bad decision. I heard you were at the hot labs. How did you make it out alive? I killed her. Who? Who? Doctors on Mua. We were going to lunch when the alarms went off. I ran into the tram. And I closed the doors. Oh dear. <laughs> she banged on the window once. Then they sliced her to pieces. Her head came apart like a melon. I closed the door. I killed her. Tell me what you know. I'll make your survival mean something. You think I want absolution? There is none. Could Matriarch Benezia survive in the hot labs? It's possible. The specimens were sensitive to biotics. I'll be leaving now. Yeah. Right. You're not part of the crew. I have Ventralis's permission to go in there. Yeah, he radioed. He also said you have to prove you're not contaminated to get out. Oh, you got a death life. wish? You should stand watches on the barricade. These are all medical kits. Oh, 
Isolated four chemicals that can be combined to counteract the toxin. They must be mixed in precise quantities. As each chemical is poured, the equipment will mark the minimum and maximum amount that will work. Too little or too much will spoil the result. I have a feeling we should save here. Just in case. Actually, it doesn't matter. Okay. Well, it's uh, nice to be prepared just in case. Nothing in there. Alright, let's make a cure. A. Okay. What the fuck? Use your AI, you know. Oh! Oh, fuck. I've got it now, so... X. Y. X. A. There we go, cure created. Your mission ends here, oh, Shepherd. hello! We'll see about that, bitch. You're a sleeper agent for Venezia. I was ordered to eliminate you should the opportunity arise. And here you are, trapped in this lab. Weapons free! Ow, that hurts. Hang on. Um. Oh. Rex, you fucking bastard. Block my fucking thing shot. There's no more limitations. Right, explosive rounds, ten. I haven't got another scram rail, have I? No. So we've got the Nagy sniper if he wants. I like him with the shotgun to be fair. Oh my god. Sorry, you're in the guard. No witness. They came out of there. You mean the get the inorganics the Asari had with her? Venezia brought them with her. How can I get into the maintenance area? A team lead would have access. Like Dr. Cohen. He's in the medical bay. I'll be leaving now. Yeah. Oh, so they came down here. With this. Alright, let's return to the doctor then. Just from there. <laughs> yeah, he is nice. Is that the cure? You did it? That Asari scientist, the one in the mess hall, she just tried to kill us. Alestia? That's unbelievable. I. I, uh, I don't know much about her. She arrived a month ago. One of the shareholders pulled strings to get her here. Let me guess. Saren the Spectre. Yes. I think that was the name. I, I don't pay attention to the other research teams. Look. The guards? They've been more on edge since you got here. I think they were expecting you. No. 
And there are more labs in the back. The guards won't even let me back there. Just people with clearance. What about the maintenance area? Do you have access to that? The maintenance area? Yes. Take my pass. But there's just snow back there. Let me see that file. An extension on Phelps' work? I thought he was on the right track. I can't thank you enough that... Oh, God, what a cliché. You saved their lives, do you know that? That's what I'm here for. Forget about it. I need to administer I don't this need, um, Medi-Gel, so... Oh. Oh well. <laughs> to be fair, we've got eight anyway, and I rarely need to use it, so. I want an armor upgrade. Oh, well, I don't. I don't even use that. Oh, there's Benancia. You do not know the privilege of being a mother. There is power in creation. To shape a life, turn it toward happiness or despair. Her children were to be ours. Apply Simon to says. Slay Saren's enemies. <laughs> I won't be moved by sympathy, no matter who you bring into this confrontation. Liara is here because she's a member of my crew. Indeed. What have you told him about me, Liara? What could I say, Mother? That you're insane? Evil? Should I explain how to kill you? What could I say? Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. I can't believe you'd kill your own daughter. I now realize I should have been strict. You told me to kill him. Oh. Help. Nah, it's fine. I can kill them. <laughs> oh. The sorry commandos are so scary. Oh no, two guests. Oh, there's more than two gaff. I think you're struggling here, aren't you? Getting a bit weak, are we? Rex? Saren is 
unstoppable. My mind is filled with his light. Everything is clear. The Rachni didn't cooperate with you. Why should I? Oh my god. I will not betray him. You will. You... Damn. Rex is a chunky boy. <laughs> you must listen. Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compulsions briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. We met Shiala on Pharos. She told us about Sovereign's indoctrination. It is a terror. To 750 G's. To beat upon the glass as your hands torture and murder. I was powerless. Nothing but a tool for Saren. He sent me here to find the location of the Mew Relay. Its position was lost thousands of years ago. Can I assume you found the coordinates? Two thousand years ago, oh, damn. the Rachni inhabited that region of our galaxy. They discovered the Relay. The Rex Rachni is definitely a chunky boy. Across generations. <laughs> Queens inherit the knowledge of their mothers. I took the location of the Relay from the Queen's mind. I was not gentle. You can still make it right. Give me the information. He's supposed to be his replacement. I was not myself, but I should have been stronger. I transcribed the data to an OSD. Take it, please. Knowing the relay's coordinates is not enough. Do you know where he planned to go from there? Vermeer. Saren wouldn't tell me his destination. But you must find out quickly. I transmitted the coordinates to him before you arrived. Oh, damn. You have to stop me. I, I can't. His teeth are at my ear. Fingers on my spine. You sh You should. Oh, you should. Mother, I don't leave. Fight him. You've always made me proud, Liara. Yeah, for four missions, yeah. Die. Oh shit. Hang on then. Hang on. Oh, you know. No! Play sight sights me from there. Okay, thank god. I cannot go on. You will have to stop him, Shepard. Hold on. We've got Medigel. Maybe we can... No. He is still in my mind. I am not entirely myself. I never will be again. <laughs> I are, yeah. Mother. Good night, little wing. I will see you again with the dawn. I mean, to be fair, she did take a sniper rifle to the face. They always said there would be a... Yeah, I've seen some of the burst fire ones. Right, will someone kill that commando? Oh no, it possesses, doesn't it? It like uses them as a, like a communic yeah serves as our voice as a conduit we cannot sin 
not in these low spaces. Your musics are colorless. Musics? What? Your way of communicating is strange, flat. It does not color the air. When we speak, one moves all. This is going to be a fun conversation. We are the mother. We sing for those left behind. The children you thought silenced. We are Rachni. How are you speaking through her? Our kind sing through touchings of thought. We pluck the springs and the other understands. She is weak to urging. She has colors we have no names for. But she is ending. Her music is bittersweet. It is beautiful. The children we birthed were stolen from us before they could learn to sing. They are lost to silence. End of their suffering. They cannot be saved. They will only cause harm as they are. Ominous ass Easter egg on Loner in this game. If you sit in the right spot, you can hear a very odd and scary noise. It is most likely the song of the Rachni. Oh yeah, there's 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 loads of them. There's there's loads on this. Like as I've been looking at the maps, there's like there's about there's several planets where it plays the song. I don't understand. Why are your children killing people? These needlemen, they stole our eggs from us. They sought to turn our children into beasts of war, claws with no songs of their own. Our elders are comfortable with silence. Children know only fear if no one sings to them. They fear are quite crazy. Their minds. I understand. A child left alone in a closet until she is 16 would not be sane. If you're sure they can't be saved. It is lamentable, but necessary. Do what you must. Before you deal with our children, we stand before you. What will you sing? Will you release us? Are we to fade away once more? There are acid tanks rigged up on that thing. Set them off. Millions of my ancestors died to put these things down. Don't let them come back. They made a mistake. They let the Krogan go too far. This is a chance for us to atone. She has done nothing to us. Your companions hear the truth. You have the power to free us. Or return our people to the silence of memory. If I let you live, would you attack other races again? No, we. Would you I leave the queen for dead or have a chance to get the uh, not dag alive? We only heard discordance. Uh, I don't know. Color of oily Kill dag. <laughs> we would seek a hidden place to teach our children harmony. If they understand, perhaps we would return. Are you a survivor from the war? A clone? We do not know. We were only an egg, hearing mother cry in our dreams. A tone from space hushed one voice after another. It forced the singers to resonate with its own sour yellow note. Then we awoke in this place, the last echo of those who came out from the singing planet. The sky is silent. I won't destroy your entire race. You'll go free. Are you stupid? Your people didn't fight these bastards. So maybe you don't get it. Yeah. Are we any better if we kill them all? Do what you want. My people will clean up this mess later, just like we did for the Solarians. All right, Rack, shut up. You will give us the chance to compose anew? We will remember. We will sing of your forgiveness to our children. Great. Bugs are writing songs about you. 
Mark my words, you'll regret this. Be free. Be free, my child. Go with grace. Right. <laughs> Be free, don't kill characters, please. <laughs> right. Um, I'm going to save it here. Because uh, I've got to have my lunch now. Um, I think we might pick this up. On, um, we'll pick this up uh, later. Um, so we'll pick up all this later. So, anyway, um, what do we want to do? Right, Sparky. Let's ride Sparky. Just make sure I type it right. Alright, so that's us done. Uh, yeah, so thank you all for watching. Uh, I will enjoy my lunch now, and uh, I will be back over the weekend, uh, probably Saturday afternoon. So, anyway, thank you all, and I will see you when I next see you. Baisy bay.